Hey, what's up? My name's Chase, and today I'm going to show you how to arch your type in InDesign. First, I've just got a blank document open here. Um, I'll zoom in a bit so you can see what I'm doing. And we're going to go to the pen tool, and basically we have to create a path, and then we're going to type on a path on top of that path that we've created. So using the pen tool, I'm going to make one dot, um, come out here by holding the shift button. We're going to create a, a straight line for that second dot, and then when we create that second dot, click, but don't let go. Hold on to it, and then drag it out. And you can see that there's a nice arch, and that arch is you know, pretty much even on both sides since I'm holding that shift button down still. Now you'll notice that there's, we can let go of it. You will notice that there's no stroke and no fill, which is great because we don't want to see that line. We just want to see the type. So once that's done, we're going to hold the T button down, the type tool, and you'll see that there's type on a path. We're going to come over here, and you'll see it hovering over this. That plus over the cursor has come up. And that just means that that's where we can start to type onto that path. So we're going to click there. And now I can start typing. So I'm just going to type in the name of my Tumblr page, which you guys can visit, which is gifweenus.tumblr.com. And if I just select all of this and then bump up the size, you guys can see that it's arching. You pretty much just have to adjust the size, you know, however you'd like it. You can also go back and adjust the um, the shape of, you know, your your uh, your line by working with the pen tool again. But that's pretty much it. It's pretty simple. Um, you know, you can do this with any kind of line you'd like. If you're going to do something jagged like this, it probably won't work because you know your your type's going whoop whoop. It's not very readable. But you know. Just pretty simple, select two points, make a curve using the pen tool, and then using the type on a path tool, we're just going to type whatever we'd like. That's pretty much it. My name's Chase, and today I showed you how to arch your type using InDesign. Thanks for watching.